It's Tuesday, everyone. Tonight we are reading Rubble's Big Wish from the Five Minute Paw Patrol Stories. Rubble and Rocky were helping Primer Owl sort through some old stuff in his barn. Rubble dug into a pile of toys. Hey, a jack in the box, he said. I'm going to clean it up and play with it, he yarned. Right after I take a little nap. Rubble curled up next up next to the toy and soon was he was asleep. He began to dream. The jack in the box started to jump around. Rubble turned the box's handle and music began to play. And then a genie popped out of the box. Rubble and Rocky gasped. Pleased to meet you, the genie said. I am Jeremy, the genie. Sign, you let me out of the box. You get three wishes. What would you like? Hmm, Rubble said, thinking, what do I really want? A bone that will last forever. Jeremy led Rubble and Rocky outside where there was plenty of room. Grant this wish to a pup so clever on big bone that will last forever. The genie chanted. The genie used his magic to make a giant bone appear in the sky. Wow! My, my wishbone, Rubble said. The bone hovered in the air for a moment, but then it fell onto the barn. Crash! It, it stuck. It was stuck in a big hole in the roof. I just graduated from genie school, Jeremy admitted. So I'm new at this. Farmer Owl ran out of his barn. He and started at and stared at the giant bone. Don't worry, Farmer Owl, Rubble said. We'll get right. Rubble and Rocky ran to the lookout. They told Ryder about a, the genie and the bone that broke the roof of Farmer Owl's barn. We'll take care of it. Ryder promised, no wishes too big, no puppets too small. Ryder called the other members of the Paw Patrol and came up with a plan. They all hurried back to the barn. Rubble, Ryder said, use your crane to lift the bone off of the roof. Rubble, rubble on the double, the pup exclaimed. Rubble lowered his claw to grab the giant bone that he raised it out of the hole in the roof. Good job, Rubble, Ryder shouted. Okay, Sky, Ryder called. You can fly Rocky and his supplies up there now. You got it, Ryder, she, Sky answered. She flew her helicopter to the roof, carrying Rocky on a platform. Rocky had some cupboard doors and shingles with him to repair the hole. Green beans go, Rocky howled. Hammer, hammer, Rocky said. His backpack opened and a hammer popped out. He started hammering the old cup doors, cupboard doors over the hole in the roof. Wow, Jeremy said. I can help with that. Using his genie magic, Jeremy floated to the shinglings into place. Rocky nailed them down in record time.
The roof was fixed, good as new, Farmer Owl said. Thank you, Paw Patrol. Rubble, Rubble set the giant bone down on the ground. On the ground, and he and the other pups ran over to it. Rubble gave it a lick. Yummy, he said. It's so big, it'll last forever. I'm happy to share it with my friends. Jeremy told Rubble he still had two wishes left, as Rubble thought he wandered around, not watching where he was going. Splosh! He slipped and fell into a mud puddle. Yuck, Rubble said. Now I know what I want. I wish for the super fuzziest bubble bath ever. This pup likes it in a tub. I'll make it warm and super bubbly. Jeremy chanted. Rubble's bubble bath was so bubbly, one giant bubble formed around the tub and lifted it into the air. I think I'm in bubble trouble, Rubble whimpered. But as he floated along in his bubble bath, in, an, in the bathtub, Rubble started to enjoy himself. This is fun, he said. Rubble saw a row of pine trees up ahead. Pine trees, he said. Oh no, one thing about pines, they sure are prickly. Pop, the prickly pines popped the bub Rubble's big bubble. He fell through the tree and landed on a limb, hanging over a river. Rubble called Ryder for help. We're on our way, Rub Ryder said. Ryder put on his harness, on a harness. Sky lowered him from her helicopter to the pine tree. A little lower sky, Ryder called. Hang tight, Rubble. Crack, just as the tree branch broke and the tub began to fall, Ryder scooped up Rubble. Gotcha, he said. Thanks, Ryder said Rubble, giving him a big lick. What's your last wish, Rubble? Jeremy asked. I wish I could do something nice for all my friends, Rubble answered. Good pups who deserve lots of good eats. Reward these pups with tons of treats. The genie chanted, Kaboom! There was a loud clap of thunder, and then it started to ring puppy treats. Yay! The pups cheered. In the barn, Ryder gently shook Rubble away. Time to go home, Farmer Al said. You were a big help. I'll say, said Farmer Al. You good, you good pups deserve some good treats. He tossed treats to Rubble and Rocky, but Rubble said, no thanks. I ate a bunch from the sky. Ryder looked confused. Are you all right? Barns can be the weird dreams, Rubble said, giggling. I hope you enjoyed this book. Make sure to share and subscribe. Have a great night.